Hello? Welcome back to Wondershare Family Safe Channel. What is OnlyFans? You might have heard about it, but in all probability, your teenager is well aware of it. OnlyFans, born in 2016, differs from your typical social media platform. It is a subscription-based service where creators ranging from sex workers, YouTubers, and fitness trainers to models and public figures share exclusive content with their fans for a fee. While it hosts content like fitness routines, music, and cooking, it has gained its fair share of attention for being a hub of adult content, or soft porn. OnlyFans has seen a surge in popularity during the COVID-19 pandemic, boasting over 3 million creators and a staggering 220 million users as of May 2023. However, OnlyFans has been criticized for not doing enough to prevent child sexual abuse material from circulating on the OnlyFans website. In October of 2021, the company announced that it would no longer allow sexually explicit material, but reversed its decision six days later due to backlash. It is important to mention that OnlyFans danger is highly defined by who uses the platform like other platforms, online privacy should be a top priority when using the platform. Over the years, users have fallen prey to promoter scams, copyright infringement, identity theft, and stalking. OnlyFans has gained popularity due to its allowance of adult content, particularly sexual content. This has made it a platform of choice for content creators in the adult entertainment industry and individuals looking to monetize their explicit content. While OnlyFans is not solely focused on sexual content, it remains one of its most prominent and lucrative categories. Content creators and fans are flooding the platform because it has no restrictions on pornography and explicit content. Sadly, it's now a hub for child sex abuse material OnlyFans caters exclusively to adults ages 18 and above, but then many sneaky youngsters try to slip in by lying about their age. Creators on OnlyFans lock their content behind a paywall, implying that you can only access them by paying. Every interaction with a creator comes with a cost. Even sending a direct message, a DM, requires payment. This setup poses a risk for children as their growing curiosity may lead them to make substantial financial transactions. Moreover, as kids grasp the concept of making money through this platform, they may be tempted to become creators. And then this can lead to creating and posting inappropriate, explicit content, all in pursuit of earning money. OnlyFans explicitly outlines in its privacy policy that its website may contain links to third-party websites, plugins, and applications. Clicking on these links or enabling connections with them may expose you to a risk of third parties collecting or sharing your personal data. OnlyFans will not take any accountability for the content, security, or privacy practices of these external websites, plugins, or applications. Creators on OnlyFans invite fans to send direct messages for personal and intimate connections. This opens the door for children to encounter online abuse such as grooming, exchanging explicit content, sexual harassment, and blackmail. The risk escalates with these virtual relationships translating into the real world, exposing children to potential harm and danger. Unlike traditional social media platforms or adult content sites, OnlyFans is not subject to the same level of oversight. There is no guarantee that content creators who are on there are who they say they are or that they're following any ethical standards. This means there is a risk of illegal activity going unnoticed or unpunished, such as setting nudes, celebrity porn, etc. Additionally, OnlyFans does not have built-in parental controls. This has made it a cause of concern for many parents. 
due to its lack of parental controls, it is really difficult to restrict access to explicit content on the platform. Parents are worried that their children might stumble upon sexual content while just browsing the internet. There are several ways that you can stop your kids from the dangers of explicit content on sites like OnlyFans. One, restrict kids' app usage. Being a concerned parent, set a time limit for your kids to browse the internet or access the apps of their choice. Make them understand that the OnlyFans app is not meant for kids, so they are not supposed to use it at all. Two, introduce them to healthier activities. There are plenty of activities that can grab kids' attention, such as outdoor games, indoor games, board games, musical instruments, cooking, water plants, painting, art, craft. There's so much. Take out some time to just interact with your kids more and help them to understand their areas of interest. Three, let kids know the negative sides of OnlyFans. There are many articles and reviews about the OnlyFans fans platform available on the internet. Various users have shared their real life negative experiences. Show your kid those negative experiences and convince them how badly this app can affect them. Four, set parental control. FamilySafe is one of the most trusted parental control solutions. With FamilySafe, you can monitor what your children are browsing online. You can ensure that your children will not get access to OnlyFans and you can limit their screen time on any platforms that are similar to OnlyFans. Not only this, parents should track where their kids are located. It is hard to keep your kids away from online content in this world where the internet is the main ruler. Rather, parents should just find ways to interact with their kids, find ways to interact without passing judgment and, and help them to understand the consequences of being exposed to inappropriate content at a sensitive age. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you in the next one.